Color, balance, and purity, the three words most people use to describe what they liked about French painter Henri Matisse's artwork. The Museum of Modern Art had an entire gallery of Henri Matisse's work. This one's called Dance. My initial impression of this was that it was almost childlike, as if a kid had painted it. But Matisse wasn't trying to paint like a kid here. He was trying to express the idea of joy and dance in a way that hadn't been done before, and which didn't involve representing the figures as realistically as possible. He wanted to show movement and dance on a flat surface. I've known Matisse for um, a long time, and the reason I love this is mostly because I respond to the color and blue and green, like the the earth and the sky, are remind me of nature. And I think what he's done with this is that he's taken a very primal scene of nature and people in their most nature state, being completely nude, and they're in a circle, which is also a, a symbol of nature and the earth circular and spherical and they're doing a dance in a circle which is just sort of celebrating life and it's very simple it's almost a cutout which he was known for doing cutouts later in his life when he couldn't see very well anymore and he had people cut out shapes so I feel like what's amazing to me about it is it's very very simple but it's very evocative of the most basic simple things about being a human on the earth and making a connection with other people and sort of celebrating life. And so mm -hmm. that's why I like it. It makes me happy. Pets of ours. This next one called Red Studio is an account of Matisse's, well, studio. His ceramics, his paintings, and sculptures. The artworks appear in color and in detail, while his room and furnishings are indicated only by negative gaps in the red surface. These negative gaps were Matisse's way of diverging from traditional linear perspective. He suggested spatial depth with a few angled lines or obscured it altogether. This made it increasingly important for the audience to be engaged and take a closer, more introspective look. No ifs, ands, or buts. Most of the artwork in this gallery was made by Matisse in the 1910s while World War I raged on across Europe. The color black assumed an important presence in Matisse's otherwise boldly colored palette. Matisse developed this particular painting of what he described as the terrace of the little cafe of the Casbah in the years following two visits to Morocco. It's called the Moroccans. As he worked on various studies, he eliminated details he felt were extraneous to the painting's overall balance. A balcony with a flower pot, and a mosque behind it are at the upper left, while at the lower left is a still life of vegetables, and to the right is a man wearing a turban seen from behind. Matisse's generous application of the color black, again, helps unify the three sections of the painting across its abstract expanse. <laughs> 